So we're here at the Milwaukee Art Museum, which is a huge landmark for the city of Milwaukee. And a big part of this landmark is the wings, which open and close, controlled by Rockwell Animation products. We're headed to Discovery World, where we'll have some eighth grade students interacting with our exhibit, The Dream Machine, making some real life connections to the things that they're learning in science and math classes. The shortage of engineering talent is something that we face here in Milwaukee and even across the globe. How's it going? Many of our students are becoming technology users but aren't understanding the importance of being creators. Jay, we wanna, you, yeah, wanna, wanna take this on Maybe here. The uh, we need the best and brightest in the world. You hear about the shortage of skilled workers entering the workforce and the gap has to be filled. It's how do we make engineering, how do we make science, how do we make math fun? That was cool. <laughs> We've had an exhibit here uh, since the museum opened. What you're looking at is the um, roof at Miller Park. We're very excited about this one because we've also been able to engage uh, some of our partners, particularly Fanuc. We need that next wave of innovation and it is about creating a pipeline for the future. Have you guys seen the wings? open and close before? It's very hard to make the point of what automation is. And by being able to point right outside the window to the Milwaukee Art Museum, that is very uh, powerful. Is that how you would do it? You program it faster? The goal is to get them excited at an early age so that they can enjoy STEM-related careers. I was always good at math and science, and my teachers told me I needed to be an engineer, and I didn't really know what they meant by that. You're always looking for something that needs to be made better. I always raised my hand and asked, why would I ever have to do this math problem again? Why would I ever use this in real life? Yeah. You guys do you use artificial intelligence on some robots? Yeah. Opportunities like this is my chance to connect them to those answers so that they're inspired to continue on and pursue their math and science.